Welcome to Supercar World TV. Probably wondering why I'm driving this Daytona 392. I stole it from my producer. And the reason why is I want to fit in today for the Tri-County Mopar Shootout here in Palm Beach International Raceway. Let's see what these Mopars can do. We're here with Rob, drag racer at night. What do you do during the day? I actually am a doctor. All right, next question is, we'll get you into Mopars. I, I grew up with Mopars. My dad was a uh, driveline engineer for Chrysler and I uh, grew up riding around in them, working on them. And I've been hooked ever since. Grew up in Michigan or? Yeah, Detroit. Really? Yep. Yeah, so that, I guess it's in your blood. It is, a, it it is, is in the uh, blood, yeah. So. I uh, spent many nights out on Woodward Avenue. And, uh, really? Yeah. yeah. Well, I probably shouldn't shouldn't admit to that. Oh, uh, I think it's after the three-year law. Yeah. <laughs> now, this one special about this car. You said it's a daily driver. Yeah. I uh, when the Demon came out, uh, I was lucky enough to uh, get get an opportunity to buy one, and uh, it's my daily driver. Uh, it really is a dual-purpose car, and I drive it to the grocery store, to the gym, to work. Um, and it's a great car. I, I, uh, I love it. Drive, drove it here tonight to the event and drive it home, hopefully. Well, yeah, hopefully in one piece. Yeah, no. Yeah, hopefully in one piece, right. Yeah. So I noticed you don't have the seat in it. It was a delete with us, or do you have it? I ordered it uh, rear seat delete and, okay. uh, without the fancy stereo, but I have the passenger seat. So I take my girlfriend out, she doesn't like sit on the, the floor. Right? Yeah, well, <laughs> you're taking a date night and a dinner. So, uh, but I take the seat out when I come up here. All and, right. Uh, so. put, uh, put the tires and equipment in there. So it works out real well. Perfect. What'd you run tonight? So far, a best of a 10-0. A 10-0? Yeah, All I'm right. spinning the tires a little bit. So I'm hoping for a 9 uh, the air, if the air gets a little better. All right. Well, we won't want to waste any more time. We're going to let you back on the yeah, track and get you a nine tonight, sir. Yeah, All right. Thank, thank you. Well, I'm here with John. This is his third Mopar. What was the first one? Uh, it was the V6 back in 2011. After that, I stepped it up. I got a 392 Scat Pack, uh, Shaker Edition. Had okay. that for about a year. It wasn't enough? It wasn't enough. enough. <laughs> Never enough. It wasn't what I wanted, I wanted. to do with All right. cars, So I went forward, I went and got the Hellcat. Okay. Uh, I've been really happy with it. How long you had it? I had it about almost two years now. I know it's not stock. So what you done? 
what's what's the good news. <laughs> well, I kept the stock for a little bit, and then I took it over to my shop, uh, American Muscle Performance. He's Great. Somewhere around here right now, Scott. I gotta sure. thank him a lot. So we started with a uh, upper pulley E85 setup, made about 800 wheel. Um, wasn't enough. <laughs> Went back, did the lower pulley. Uh, basic mods, intake, got the tensioner. Changed the pulley again for more boosts, making a little bit north of 900 wheel right now. All right, so what'd you run today? Today, the best time in the car so far is the 9.6. A 9.6? Oh, nine that was, six. all right, yeah. 9.6 at I Probably one of the fastest ones here today. Maybe. There's, there's, there's one with a parachute, but we won't count that one. Yeah, we yeah that doesn't count. <laughs> That's so. a full, full race car. Yeah. It's a full street car, full interior, AC still. Uh, consistent, I can daily drive it. You drive it every day? Yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. All right, so what's the next thing you're going to do to it? Next thing, um, I don't know, maybe a nitro shot. A nitro shot? A hundred? A hundred shot? hundred shot? Go from there. So, you going to take it for a run now? Yeah. I'm All right. Go to get a run in, wait for everything to clear up. Perfect. Don, yeah. we'll see you on the track. Awesome. Hope you break your uh, low nine you're looking for. Yeah, I'm trying to do a nine, nine five nine. tonight. We'll see what happens. And the nitrous hopefully will get you under nine, no? Yeah, definitely. All right. We'll see. All right. Thank you. Well, I'm here because of Johnny, the president of Tri-County Mopars. Met Johnny at Cars and Coffee, and uh, that's how I ended up here today filming this. So Johnny, tell us about the show and a little bit how you got into okay. All right. the Mopars. Well, I'm Johnny. Um, I started this a year ago yesterday, which was um, February 5th of uh, 2018. And today is our one-year anniversary track rental event. Right. Awesome. And, uh, you know, we have over probably 30-something cars tonight running. We have a couple members out here in the parking lot, and um, I'm very excited uh, yeah. to have you guys here and, and film well, us. You know, thank you. So, thank we're, you. We're glad it's well organized, yeah. and but to be a Mopar guy, got to own a Mopar. Got to. So, first one? Second one. What'd you have before then? I had another charger, but it was a baby charger, uh, a, was V6. It was it, uh, a V6. But this one is, uh, you know, more of a man's car. Yeah. Right here. You almost didn't make it. <laughs> almost didn't make it. Um, to your own event. Transmission uh, problems. Um, the freight company that delivered the tranny um, delivered it at 2 o'clock today. And, uh, you know, my tranny guys, um, they definitely put in the work to get me in here, even though I made it like an hour and a half late, you know, but yeah. I'm here. That's all that matters. Yeah, that's right. I'm so, ready to, you know, hopefully get in the nines. Well, Sorry, for transmission that put in the car, when they finish it? 4.30, 5? Uh, no, like 5.30. 5.30? Yes. Yeah. Well, now, right, let's get this thing on the track, and I'm sure you can't wait any more. <laughs> can you? Yeah. No, I can't wait. I yeah. Can't All right, man. Wait. Let's get this thing and see if we can get it low nines. Hopefully. All hopefully. right. <laughs> Well, you just watched another great episode of Supercar World TV. I tried to hide the McLaren, but hey, a bunch hey, of guys. Hey, oh, what's that? King Russo, King Hellcat. What we got here? It's a pretty car, man. Look, thank you. you. What's yeah. Good, man? Well, we're just trying to wrap up the show. It was a great show. 
No, no, we're gonna get a run, and I've been trying to run one. No, no, it's time to go home. No, no, no we're not going home. Gotta get a Mopar. Uh, right they'll there, keep man. it open for us. Keep it open for us. Yeah, I think we got minute. another run there. You got, you got just enough time to get smoked real quick. Uh, <laughs> all right, so we're not ending the show. Nope. We're gonna hit the track one more time. Johnny, I want to thank you for inviting us. I'm not sure if I want to thank you, but you kicked my butt out there. So, and then I want to thank you for the magic shirt because I left with a Supercar World TV shirt and I ended up with this one. Got smoke marks, uh, you got it. So please like and subscribe. See you soon.